My name is Umel, and welcome to... to... So I want to make Zuma Deathblade a bodyguard for uh, my host Krishna Tracker. Hey, here he is. Perfect. I know every inch of this black land. If you try to run, I will not rest till you are dead. I'm not trying to run. I was just trying to find you. The command. So you're mine now, and so you're gonna become Host Chris the Tracker's uh, bodyguard. So this is working out nicely. So get out of here. So get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. But he had to call that horn before he did this. So, ooh. Oh, you're one of my uh, one of my guys. So who are you? Oh, it's Manbreaker. Well, I was sending Hostcrush after you. I was sending a uh, Hostbreaker uh, after you, but uh, Hostcrush, I mean. But if you're gonna be here, I was planning to make you a bodyguard to replace. Uh, Uh, making you a bodyguard to replace uh, the drooler, Horza. So I guess I'll make you a replacement bodyguard now. So yeah, things are weird now. So let's get out of here before anyone else shows up. But what's with all these guys? I, I wonder how many of them have ambushers and uh, tracker traits. Hey, there's a Karagor. I'm bringing you some food. Hope you enjoy. Not me. There you go. Okay, so I'm going to check out all these quests. Oak with the Reds, Trial of Ordeal. Uh, Thakrak Manbreaker is doing a beast hunt. Hushka the Tracker awaits my command. Good, he's deactivated that. And Zomug Deathblade's doing a recruitment. And then I got Horhog doing the ride against Ashkar and the Serpent. And I can do the Lord of Mordor, but I don't want to even attempt that until all my guys are level 20. So let's help Thakrak Manbreaker become the bodyguard of Norsko. Uh, then you know you got Deathblade and you got Ogbur the Red. And then you have uh, these two I want to make bodyguards as well. Horza had to throw a little bit of a wrench in my plans. I hope it's ghouls or caragors. It's caragors. I didn't want it to be a graug. There we are. This hunt's about to get fun. I 
Hey, Thakrak, go after them. There you go. Now you're a bodyguard. I'll let you go about your business, but I do want some intel. Yeah, you made the kill. So, you're going to give me some intel now. Oh, I got some new guys here at the bottom row. That's cool. So, let's get some uh, new intel on these guys since they just joined. So I'll dismiss you now. So get going. So let's get some health. Anyway, that's him out of the way. So let's get Ogber the Red. Uh, his thing out of the way. right by this uh here so he's doing a trial board deal which isn't that bad it's literally just him facing like one caragor are you joking this isn't even a challenge i just realized i got two guys with uh There, he won. Simple as that. He would have killed it anyway. I just didn't want to bother waiting. Alright, and I want to gain some more intel. You're not one of mine. That was a headshot. So you're going to give me some intel now. I got a bunch of new guys I want to look at. Ooh, ugly face. Yeah. Ironically, he's actually pretty strong. And another tracker. Well, anyone that looks unique, I might make into another bodyguard. Because I think you can have, like, up to three bodyguards per uh, war chief. Uh, okay, so that's Ogwa the Red taken care of. So now I just got Zumug here. He's doing a recruitment. And then it's right beside Horhog, who's doing a riot against one of the guys I don't want to keep. And the thing with here is now that I've made Ogber the Red uh, Horhog's bodyguard, this riot that uh, Horhog's doing will actually have. Uh, Two of my captains present against only one captain. So yeah, it's a uh, very well, uh, like a nice thing to do is have bodyguards for your war chiefs. And then when you're sending your war chiefs out to do stuff, but I don't want to have uh, three people. Uh, per uh, character, because I'm not sure like which characters I'm gonna, I have are going to become uh, going into like the Nemesis Forge, so I'm kind of just wanting to have uh, like two, at mo like one of each, two at most, because I want to have some Nemesises in a uh, Nemesis Forge. Well, that's a good thing you are going to die. All right, that's what, stage one down. All right, Zumug, where's the next group? This way? Oh, they're over here.
All right, so who do I got to take out? And you. And the last group is right over here. better he's just trying to get you to join his ranks there we go deathblade now you've got bodyguards for everybody but uh, two of them Hey, I want some more intel and some more guys. Okay, the slippery. I have to admit, that guy's probably got the smoothest skin I've seen on a, uh, <laughs> on an Uruk. And he's got a lot of hates, but he's very vulnerable to combat and stealth, so that can, uh, change. And he has no chance. All those hates are probably why he's called the Slippery. Because he becomes enraged by pretty much anything. So, yeah, you're gone now. And I'm right beside the next uh, point here. Actually, like, up here where I need to go to collect the... Uh, a Karagor, wow. Okay, it's right there. Oh, I got full elf shot, never mind. I forgot branding gives me that. So Asgard, I'm the serpent, and it's a riot. So I got two guys here. The Red Legion, as I want to call it. Not a reference to Destiny 2. Quick work of your oh, he lost his bloody weapon. Stop talking. Time to kill each other now. Kill, you now. kill the troublesome guys first. Hey there, Serpent. I got a smoker's cough. All right, guys. I got you the serpent here, and there's two of you. Okay, come on. Stop lighting our own guys on fire, Ogber. Please behead him. No. Well, he might still be alive. But the blood hand gets uh, power. So I'm going to send the blood hand after someone and I'm going to get Ogber to give me uh, information on that guy. So, you're going to give me info on some, uh, no. I'm going to command you to, you're 18, so I'm sending you after whoever this guy is. Hornblower, let me guess, he had a summoner? Oh, obviously I don't know yet. And Ogber. You're going to give me intel. So 
he's got re regeneration and no chance. He's got fury and rapid attack. He's got throat grab, invulnerable to self, hate of grabs. Yet he does not have summoner, which is when they actually blow the horns. I feel uh, cheated. Oh, look who it is. It's the ugly. You just have to show up and make him uh, stronger. Well, hey, ugly face, it's not like I brought it here. Really? So this is how I'm gonna have to hurt him. But you have a unique look to you. So I do want you to be a bodyguard. Let's do some combat brands. Get these Karagors out of here. Have my guys here fight them. More Karagors? Another guy that shows up with a hate of Karagors. Yeah, so no, I'm not fighting all these guys. If it was just the ugly, I would have, uh, Gotten them. But more and more Karagors keep showing up. As do more and more, uh, uh, dudes. I forget the term there. Okay, so I'm sending a Horhog Bloodhand after him. So it was, uh, Ugu the Tiny that showed up. It also has a hate of Karagors. Okay. So who do I want to go after next? Well, I'll track Horhog. I've got him doing a quest. Yeah, I got all these, uh, guys moving about. So, just a horn blower. He's got a lot of hates, but he's not really that strong otherwise. Do you really think you have a chance against me? You shrug and die, you shrug and shrug! Hey, watch your tongue. He's got a lot of just basic guys. Get some more guys on my side. Hey there. <laughs> Ready for me to crush you like a rotten fruit, you shrug. Oh, 
Okay, watch your language there, buddy. There we go. I know it was who it was that killed him. It was uh, his bodyguard that got him. Ogber. I don't want you to uh, die, but I got a job for you. You got one more level to go before you're uh, level 20. So I'm gonna command you to go after someone else I don't really care about. So let's go with Lapbag the Warrior. And it's literally at the same spot. And you are gonna give me intel. On some of these guys' abilities. So Ogre the Red, because he's been surviving uh, these same riots, his Horhog has also been leveling up, which is nice. Uh, but I want intel on Crackhorn the Hacker. He's got a lot of vulnerabilities. Uh, I mean, he's vulnerable too. Uh, but he's got some decent weapons and abilities. And a lot of these change when he becomes branded, so a lot of this doesn't really matter quite yet. Oh, those are actually my guys. I was wondering, like, who are they talking to? Yeah, it's up here. Thank you all for watching the video. This is Yumel from Yumel Gaming. And if you wish for future content, please like, subscribe, comment, show your support. It's really appreciated. And I hope to see you guys next time. Later.